Hey guys, TLR here. Did you see that uh, dirt road right there? I think we should go have some fun. So I was out here vlogging and I saw this sweet dirt road and I figured, hey, let's ride down the sweet dirt road. This is like a really nice dirt road. The gravel is a little gravelier than I'm used to. It's kind of fishtailing just a little bit, but uh, let's see where this road goes. This is like really gravelly gravel. Like there's there's tight pack gravel where there's not much loose stuff on the top. And this one's just like all loose stuff everywhere. Just lots and lots of loose stuff everywhere. I'm just gonna keep going. Hopefully I'm not illegally trespassing. This is some pretty country though. I mean, this is really attractive country. Just look at all this farmland and everything going on. This is nice. I like that a lot. My, my tires are just going everywhere, all over the place, back and forth, left and right. Oh my gosh. Man, I can't wait until I get a supermoto or a dual sport or wow, we're getting into like super gravelly stuff now. And I can go out and do this kind of stuff just for the fun of it. Oh, I have a tractor coming up. I doubt warp stabilization is going to help with these cameras at all. Just saying. <laughs> We're back on pavements. I know how to ride pavements. So that's not bad. Wait, there's more dirt road. <laughs> I'll have to turn around. Is there? No, there's no one behind me. I can turn around wherever I want because there's no one around here. This is one of the great things about being out here is there's just there's just no one around at all. No one, no one's here. Okay, I have found more dirt roads. One of them is over a bridge. One of them is like straight up dirt. Uh, let's go check up the straight up dirt one. I'm not going through the mud. I don't care what you say. I'm not going through the mud. It's not happening. I care about my bike more than that. Plus, I would bash, bash up my fenders, and I really don't want to pay for more fairings right now, you know? I don't know how far I'm going to be able to... I'm probably going to get myself in trouble here. Oh, yeah. Yeah, there's, there's no way around. I'm totally going to have to turn around. Hmm. Now, if I was on a dual sport, I would just go for it, but not 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 on the sports bike i don't know what do you think do you guys i think i think uh there's uh, i think i'm stuck okay let's let's try this can i can i back up and turn around without getting off the bike i don't know the the streets around here are pretty good streets <laughs> the dirt road is pretty good around here let's let's see what we can do <laughs> also if i didn't really care too much about this bike i would be perfectly cool as well with going through the mud. But I do care about this bike because it's my only bike and I don't want to bash it up. Okay, on to the other dirt road, which is now super dusty. Dust in the face. Hmm, this is interesting. What do you think? Uh, water purification? Montebello Well ATF Booster Station. Whoa! Almost lost it. It's a water station of some kind, probably for water pressure, because it's a booster station. That's that's my guess. Could you imagine living at the end of a dirt road on a motorcycle? You'd have to clean your chain like literally every time you went out. Ooh, I might go down there. When I was doing sales in Texas, I would go out to places like this all the time. So far off the beaten path, no one knew why they were there. I bet you this is private land. That's definitely not private land, but I think this is private land. I'm gonna go down anyway. Hopefully they're cool with it. Well, see, this is nice. This is like regular everyday dirt dirt. And it's just, it's packed down. I don't want to go too fast in case I hit a rut or something. Ooh, getting exciting here. Ooh, going some ruts. <laughs> yeah, I'm definitely on private land farm, land stuff. <laughs> Someone's going to be like, why is that white motorcycle out there? What's going on? <laughs> Get off my property. <laughs> Ooh, oh, uh. <laughs> when in doubt, throttle it out. <laughs> that got exciting. I did not plan that, that path very well. This is probably the nicest dirt I've gone on yet. And just look how hard pack it is and everything. It's sweet. Mr. Farmer, I hope you don't mind me being out here. Back onto the main road. Whoop. <laughs> oh man, sliding back and forth just a little bit. I wonder how it would feel different if I was like on knobbies or something. I wonder if it's supposed to feel kind of slippery, like it's not really supposed to feel super planted. Because, uh, I mean, it's not. The Ninja 300 on road, super planted. Otherwise, no, that's a big pothole that needs to get covered up. 
<laughs> Seems I have reached the northernmost end of whatever street I'm currently on. Uh, let's go this way, because I have no idea where it ends up. Oh wow, look at that. Mallard ducks everywhere. Huh. Okay. That is obviously private land. That is obviously private land. Okay, I guess I'll head south. Okay guys, that's all I got for you today. I hope you enjoyed our little off-road adventure. If you want to support the channel, feel free to shop on Amazon through any of the links below. Like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys later. Wheel, let us pull over and we shall go from there. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna be seeing anyone anytime soon. Okay, so this one.